Welcome back to Nay Waste at St John's. Last time we showed you how we produce these flakes from HDP milk bottles and also by shredding the caps we're able to make this range of colours. But what happens to them now? What use are they? Uh, to help us answer that question we're joined today by Professor Plastic, the leader of our small team here. Professor, what's the next stage in this process? Mr. Clark, fantastic question and thank you for the introduction. Um, what do we do with it? That's a very, very good question. We can re reprocess, recycle all of it, uh, but if we don't use it for something that's positive at the end of it, then there's no point. So today I have a couple of helpers with me who are going to help demonstrate how to make a sheet. Now we have this machine, uh, which is a sheet press. Now basically what it does, it's two heated elements with uh, a couple of heavy pads that push together and crush the plastic as it heats up to form these sheets. To make the thick sheets, what we do is we have these little spacer bars that we place on the cassette, which allows the material to become thicker. Now we use the white milk bottles for the majority of the, of the sheet. Uh, what we do is we add in some coloured pigment from the, the coloured uh, caps. Now the pigment is very strong and a little bit of it goes a really long way. So if you put too much in, we can just get a whole sheet of that colour. We can set both of these plates independently to a different range of temperatures from you know, 100 degrees up to about 220 degrees. Now, depending on the type of plastic that's in it, you would obviously set it differently. Now, HDPE has a melting point between about 130 and 140 degrees. We've it up a little bit and we're going to put it in at 160 degrees and bake it for 10 minutes. Thank you, Professor. You can see why he's a professor, he knows a lot about plastic. HDP is an amazing material and we need to make sure that when we use it, we use it to its full extent and as much as possible. Next time on Nay Waste at St John's, we'll be showing you how we can take this sheet material and use traditional skills or also a laser to make brand new products. Thank you for watching Nay Waste at St John's. Nay Waste!